Welcome back. It's 742. Time now for Around Town. Yeah, Anna's at the construction site for the Chicago Fire. Hey, up, Anna. How cold does this look? Let's see. Check this out. I am 60 feet deep into the ground. Wow. Huh? Wow. And we went down all these stairs. It was like six stories. Pretty much, right, Joe? Yep, we're about six stories down now. Everybody, this is Joe Burns. He's with the engineering company, the structural engineers, right? Right. So where am I right now? We're at the bottom of the coffer dam. Of the spire. Of the spire. Mm -hmm. The coffer dam is a temporary uh, hole we're digging in order to put in the central core of the building. The core is um, the shaft that in includes the elevators, the stairs. Uh, the utilities that will support all of the buildings and get us up to the top of the building. We have some video, some animation of what you've been doing because underground where we're sta standing, there's already around 20, what you call them, caissons? Caissons. Pillars, caissons. 20 rock caissons. Mm -hmm. These are columns that go uh, to the uh, rock, which is about 110 feet from the, from the, from the street level. Mm -hmm. And that will support the weight of the tower. We have a total of, uh, of 34 of these caissons. Um, which are uh, 10 foot diameter concrete columns. Think mm -hmm. of them that way. You got it. And uh, we have 20 of them here to support the middle of the building, and we have mm -hmm. 14 around the perimeter that hold up the outside columns of the building. What's great about the spire is that when it's finally built in 2011, you won't see anything but that the spire. No parking lot, no nothing, just a park and this tall, tall building, right? That's right. As you look around us, this is all temporary. This will go away as we build the parking. Is that safe? Are I, you taking this all out? Safe. Yeah, oh, yeah. <laughs> It's, it will come out mm -hmm. when we dig down, and, and all the earth around this mm -hmm. will become parking. 1,500 cars that support the tower, um, that support the, uh, all the, uh, the, the places for people to park that, that live in the tower. How happy are you that 30% of the building is already We're sold? We're very excited about that. This project's going ahead. Were you a little afraid that if it wasn't going to sell, you're going to have to bring all this down? Uh, no, no. Never, never in doubt. Never, never in doubt. What is the biggest challenge, Joe, of a structure like this? Well, the biggest challenge, uh, there's two big challenges. One is building this tall, 2,000 mm -hmm. feet. It's a very, it's a super high-rise building. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, that, that sort of challenge to, to support it against wind and gravity and everything like that. But the other in Chicago is foundations. This right. is the deepest basement that anyone's ever put in Chicago. And we're it's flooding down. already. I'm just kidding. No, we're not. <laughs> it's not. It's not flooding. Uh, but this is water that seeps in. We're going to pump it away. Mm -hmm. You already um, are, right? You can see the caisson over there. Mm -hmm. There's one that's uh, of the 20 that's out of the ground. And we're using mm -hmm. that as a sump to pump the water away. Um, but that, the, the, the video that, that uh, the viewers are watching mm -hmm. show the actual insulation of the, the bathtub around, the, the basement wall that, that will be the permanent basement wall. I, I think the video also showed the insulation of this coffee. Yes, dam. it did. Thank you so much, Joe. You're welcome. When we come back, we're going to go outside and play a little more in this construction site, which is unbelievable and one of a kind. Back to you guys. Okay, right. thanks, thanks Anna. Anna.